نعم uh, سمية from the KSA says is it sunnah to cover one's head and will one be rewarded for doing so in some countries that's a big issue they perceive it as not a sunnah it's a matter of iman or kuf it is not to that extent wearing a kufi or a head cover for men is mere permissible so if I decide to take my kufi off right now and have my head bare without uh, head cover for a man it is permissible whether in the prayer or outside the prayer I know that in Hanafi madhab and some of the sub madhab they consider praying without the head cover for men makruh, disliked ordinary people will consider it haram but nobody says it's haram literally it is disliked yet let me ask you this in ahram men what do we do? We make sure that our heads are uncovered. صح? How do we pray? Without a kufi, without a turban. So if it is permissible to pray and make tawaf during ihram without a turban, then there is no way that it can be disliked to offer the prayer some other times without the kufi. This is just, you know, in addition to the text, some logical references. The Prophet ﷺ sometimes have taken his qalan surah off the head cover and put it in front of him as a sutra and he prayed sometimes bareheaded you can't do that but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says ya ayyuhal ladhina amanu khudhu zinatakum inda kulli masjid wear your best adornment while going to every masjid to attend the jama'ah so in some cultures they consider the thob particularly the white the turban or the kufi in some areas it must be green in some areas they wear it uh, red, even though the red is disliked, the plain red. There is a difference of opinion in this regard, but the Prophet ﷺ forbade wearing plain red, as you all know, as we discussed this before. But if you go to Nigeria, if you go to some parts of Africa, they wear the red kufi. It's a, a little darker red, a brick red, not a bright red. Uh, some areas in Turkey, they wear the green one. In Afghanistan, they wear the black one. So it's cultural. So if it is the zina according to your culture and you wear it with this intention you go to the masjid wearing your best zina, you will be rewarded for that. So it does not have to be a sunnah in Egypt or in Europe or in the States because in Islamabad you wear a kufi or in Bangladesh you wear a kufi. If the imam is praying without the kufi, his prayer is valid and the followers prayers is valid as well. I'm saying this because I know that some people are very strict when it comes to this. They consider praying without a kufi as invalid. No, that is not true. Praying with the kufi or without the kufi is valid if you fulfill the remaining conditions. But if you are living in a country or locality where they perceive the head cover as their customs and is a part of the zina, then it becomes recommended to do so. And it's not applicable everywhere else, as we discussed earlier. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept from all of us. Ya ayyuhal ladhina amanu ati'u allaha wa ati'u al-rasoola wa ulil amri minkum.